Welcome to Everyday Linux User. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to share Wi Fi with your virtual machines. Okay, so the first thing you'll need to do is obviously you need a virtual machine set up. Um, check out one of my other videos that shows how to install an Ubuntu virtual machine. Um, it doesn't matter which virtual machine you have in VirtualBox, uh, these instructions will work for um, uh, all the ones I've tried anyway. So the first thing you need to do is install the extension pack. So you um, go to Chrome and what we're going to do is we're going to search for VirtualBox extension pack. And you're going to go to downloads. Now, if you're on the latest version of VirtualBox, you can just go to the host uh, and you can see here you've got VirtualBox extension pack all supportive platforms and it shows you the version number. So check the version number. You can do that within VirtualBox. Uh, help about, you can see I'm on 6.1. So I don't want to use that one. I want to go down here and I'm going to click VirtualBox older builds. I'm going to go to 6.1. It's in active maintenance. And then you can see uh, down here you've got the extension pack and you click on that and it downloads and then you open it up and it will give you the install option so in my case it's saying reinstall in your case it will say install uh, i'm not going to reinstall it because um, i've already got it installed so once that's installed um, if you're using windows you can skip the next little section but for linux you'll need to do this uh, you'll need to open a terminal and you're going to need to type in the following command and it is sudo space user mod space minus a that's lowercase a space minus capital g space vbox users space and then your username so my name in my case it's uh, gary and then you press return and then you have to enter your password uh, so once that's done, you have to reboot your computer. Uh, it's important that you do that. Um, and the reason for that is it, it's going to enable you to share your USB devices with your virtual machine. So Windows users and Linux users, hope you're both back here um, at this point um, because um, now we're into the important bit. Uh, you can't share your normal network connection with your guests, so your normal Wi-Fi, um, your normal network connection will always come through as a uh, Ethernet connection, a wired connection on your guest machine. If you want to actually have Wi-Fi on the guest machine, you're going to have to use a Wi-Fi dongle. So, if I, I'll show you what I mean. I'm not selling this stuff, by the way. This is just an example of what you'll need. So uh, from Amazon, I'm typing in TP-Link Wi-Fi dongle. And what we're looking for is something like this. Uh, so this one's perfect. Uh, 6.99 is a Wi-Fi dongle. And you plug that into your USB drive on your computer. Important, if it asks, if you're on Windows, for instance, and it asks to install drivers, do not do that. Uh, because you don't want the USB um, adapter associated with the host PC in any way. Even though it's plugged into the host PC, you don't want the host PC to know anything about it. So I've inserted my USB dongle. I'm going to click on settings within um, VirtualBox. I'm going to go down to USB. And you can see um, with the extension pack installed, you get USB 1.1, 2, and 3. If you don't have the extension pack installed, it probably only just shows USB 1.1 and it won't work. So I'm going to choose USB 3. I'm going to click the plus symbol and it gives me the list of um, things I want to share. So I could share my um, microphone and my headphones with the virtual machine. I can, I can share um, Bluetooth with the virtual machine. Uh, the Wi-Fi adapter and my mouse. Um, now, by default, my mouse gets shared anyway, but um, I'm going to click this. Uh, this is my Wi-Fi dongle, and I'm going to click OK. 
Now I'm going to start my virtual machine, uh, which in this case is Ubuntu. I'll click on my username, I'm going to log in. Switch to full screen, uh, just to make it clearer. And then up in the top right corner, you can see if I click there, I've got a, a wireless um, connection there. Um, now that would just say Wi-Fi, um, but I've already connected to the Wi-Fi here. So I can do select network and you can see all my Wi-Fi um, connections available there. And if I go to Firefox, and as you can see, that's worked. We're using the Wi-Fi dongle to connect to the Wi-Fi uh, within the virtual machine. And that's the end of the video. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button for more of these um, videos. And thank you for watching.